guys welcome back to my channel i hope every single person is doing great as you all know today is friday and the time duration is around 9 am in the morning and today we are going to do we are, we are doing a q and a session regarding the process what is happening in this and apart from that we are going to address the query regarding the process and if i'll talk about today's update right now the thing is uh, if you are looking for the work visa appointment there might be possibility you'll get the appointment or the chances are very low because as you all know the peak time is wednesday जैसे आप सबको पता है जो पीक टाइम है वेंसडे रहता है एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट इफ आई टॉक अबाउट टू डेज फ्राइडे एंड इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर द अपॉइंटमेंट इन वर्क वीजा कैटेगराइजेशन सो दे आर वेरी लो चांसेस ऑफ गेटिंग द अपॉइंटमेंट टुडे बट डू वन थिंग इफ यू हैव टाइम दैन कीप एन आई ऑन द वेबसाइट दर माइन बी पॉसिबिलिटी विल गेट द अपॉइंटमेंट एंड इफ आई टॉक अबाउट द स्टडी वीजा कैटेगराइजेशन सो देर आर हाई चांसेस ऑफ गेटिंग द अपॉइंटमेंट टूडे ऑल्सो सो द <coughs> if i talk about the peak time for student visa categorization that is from monday till friday from 9 am till till 5 pm uh, so keep an eye on the website 247 from 9 am to 5 pm i can say if they will release the slots uh, so there might be possibility you will get the appointment and apart from that if i talk about the process right now we are doing a q and a session i'm going to address the query regarding the process there are so many questions asked from the by the candidate regarding the process so we are going to check that so if i'll go ahead with the first question that is asked from the candidate he is i think the candidate is from sri lanka location so they have asked a query regarding the process the first question is bro i have found the reason why the otp code is not coming the polish government has investigated all the corruption and frauds committed by indian vfs global so after that temporarily stop opening slots now the appointment date is limited i don't no how it will affect other countries but in sri lanka the otp code is received only by a sim card network called mobitel applicant do not know about this so this is how the applicant are restricted to go to india these days another thing is that we don't know how this will affect india i'm talking about sri, sri lanka uh, so now the candidate is only talking about the sri lanka location he is saying that as you all know people from uh, sri lanka bangladesh nepal and there was one more location uh, where the candidate are facing the otp issue they are not getting the otp on their registered mobile number that is happening due to some extension here the candidate is saying that uh, so if you guys are from sri lanka so the candidate is saying that he is using the mobitel service network the sim card of mobitel company and he is getting the otp on that particular number and i don't know this how much this is true but the thing is if you want to try you can give it a try and apart from that If you are talking about the scam thing, that is happening from a long time early also. In the month of September 2023, they said that a lot of corruption happened in the VFS Global. Now they are revoking the contract with the third-party visa companies. So there are so many other so so many companies who are working as a third-party company. They are acting as a customer-facing service provider company. So they are collecting the document from. There are so many companies who are working as a customer service. कस्टमर सर्विंग और आई कैन से फ्रंट लाइन सर्विस प्रोवाइडर जो क्या करते हैं दे आर कलेक्टिंग द डॉक्यूमेंट्स फ्रॉम द एप्लीकेंट एंड देन दे आर शेयरिंग द डॉक्यूमेंट विद द एम्बेसी सो दे सेट दे आर रिवोकिंग द कॉन्ट्रैक्ट विद ऑल द थर्ड पार्टी कंपनीज सो थर्ड पार्टी कंपनीज हु वर वेल वर हेल्पिंग दैम सो हु हेल्प दैम इन पास्ट बट द थिंग इज दैट ओनली हैपन फॉर वन मंथ इन सेप्टेम्बर दे रिवोक द कॉन्ट्रैक्ट विद ऑल द कंपनीज एंड देन वी स्पेशली आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट द वी एफ एस they said a lot of corruption is happening now they are not going to outsource the work to some other company but and they started uh, doing the operation on their own so they start they implemented a new process for one month and where they implemented electronic draw and they said now there are zero chances of getting uh, zero chances of corruption so that's why they are implementing that that particular thing but later on if i'll talk about the month of december again they outsource the work to vfs and now you can see what is happening the corruption is still there people are getting the appointment paid appointment and uh, so still the scenario is same corruption is there people are getting the paid appointment uh, vfs is not releasing the slots manually so the, if i talk about the quantity that is very low if i talk about last two if i talk about last to last month agar main last do mahine ki agar aapko data wagera provide karu to december 23 ke baad in logon ne apne slots wagera release hi nahi kare hain agar manually agar dekha jaye to If I talk about the peak time, as per the embassy guideline, they are saying that there is only one day when they are releasing the slot. That is on Wednesday. If I talk about Wednesday, the scenario is entirely different. If you are supposed to log in, then log in is not possible. And the problem is in the whole process. As per the guidelines, the peak time is from 11 a.m. till 2 p.m. But I think 
many of the time most of the time i can say the site is not serviceable people are not able to log in on that particular point of time if they are able to log in then the slots are not available over there so this is this is happening from a very long period of time if i'll talk about uh but i think the i'm following the site from last 1.2 years 1.5 years i can say there is also problem but the scenario is still same earlier they said a lot of weep, a lot of uh, corruption is going on but again they did the same thing they fired few employees from their organization and after two months they outsourced the work again to vfs same thing is happening right now so i think it will remain same so they are not going to take any other measures for the for streamlining this process it will go on like this only try to log in on time or dekho apna jo peak time hai so if you are able to log in then check the appointment if they will release a slot you would be able to get the appointment but the chances are very low so there is only one day when they are releasing releasing the slot that is on wednesday there are the other thing is vvs global is selling polen appointment from 8000 800 dollar to 1500 dollar for bangladeshi applicant they directly involved in crimes this service should be banned so if i'll talk about the paid appointment right now the price is around 1.10 lakh to 1.20 lakh so agent are charging that much amount so that is happening that is a kind of cor- corruption and i can say that is a crime but the thing is the vfs is not releasing the slots manually so i think the people are people are candid i can say they are only left with one option that is paid appointment and in that particular thing also people are getting scammed they are not getting the appointment they are not getting the genuine appointment there are few agents they are scamming the people and so this is happening from a very long period of time so earlier the charges were if i'll talk about the last year the charges were around 30000 that it has been later on uh, the amount was increased to 60000 and now if i'll talk about right now the charges are 1 lakh 10000 to 1 lakh 20000 so i think i don't think that is the right way of booking the appointment and i think paying 1 lakh 20000 for appointment is not worth at all so i do not promote the paid appointment and neither i deal with the paid appointment uh, this is not particularly restricted to bangladesh area if i'll talk about other location in india also the scenario is same people are getting the people are agents are selling the paid appointment and if i'll talk about right now people are doing the right now the slots are not available from last two months if you'll go through the website and still people are doing the submission so there is only one option available <coughs> so those who have a lot of money or i can say those who can afford they are going ahead with the paid appointment and they are doing the submission and the ratio is entirely same that is 10% out of 100% there are 90% chances of getting the rejection if you file fall under 10% category that there might be possibility you will get the appointment re appeal ke baad reaction aa gaya to fir kya hoga fir kya kuch nahi hoga bhai apna jo aapka paisa aur baad time barbaad aur kuch nahi hai ki stamp aapki reaction ki lag jayegi aapke jo passport hai उसके बाद आप कुछ नहीं कर सकते हो दो ऑप्शन मिलते हैं आपको बस हो गया एक बार आप सबमिशन करते हैं देन द अदर ऑप्शन इज आपका री अपील वी एफ एस इज टू मच हैंड इट्स टू मच करप्शन या ब्रदर दैट दैट इज हैपनिंग फ्रॉम अ लॉन्ग टाइम वी कैन नॉट डू एनीथिंग फ्रॉम आर एंड सो दिस इज वट दे आर डूइंग फ्रॉम देर एंड सो दे हैव नॉट टेकन एनी अदर मीजर इफ दे आर अवेयर ऑफ द थिंग इफ दे आर अवेयर ऑफ द प्रोसेस दैट if they they will implement uh, this vfs polen vfs polen process appointment process through vfs then i think they would be aware of the outcome what is going to happen but but still they have outsourced the work again to vfs now the process is same people are not getting the appointment agent are selling the appointment at very high price so we cannot say anything i cannot do anything from my end you cannot do anything from your end so let's wait what is going let's wait and see what is going to happen next contact me for appointment so be aware be aware of the agents right now if i talk about the comment section there are so many agents who are mentioning their information right here so i would not be responsible for this thing neither i deal in paid appointment there might be possibility they can do scam with you so it's your sole responsibility if you are booking the appointment through any of the agent agar comment section ke andar koi bhi apna agent number provide karta hai aur aap uske through apna appointment book karte hain तो आपकी सारी रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी रहती है और स्कैम भी हो सकता है आपके साथ और मैं रिस्पॉन्सिबल नहीं रहूँगा इसके लिए अभी भी आपको बता रहा हूँ और अगर आपको अपॉइंटमेंट अगर किसी भी स्ट्रेंजर से आप अपॉइंटमेंट बुक करते हैं हाई चांसेस होते हैं आपका कि आपके साथ स्कैम हो जाए 
लास्ट टू लास्ट टाइम भी ऐसा हुआ था जिसमें एजेंट वगैरह उसमें नंबर शेयर कर रहे थे बट वो लोग स्कैम कर रहे थे तो थोड़ा बच के रहो उनसे ब्रदर प्लीज लेट मी नो इफ रिबुक सिस्टम इज गोइंग टू बी लॉन्च अगेन ऑन ऑन सो देर इज नो अपडेट एज ऑफ नाउ दे आर नॉट शेयर एनी नोटिफिकेशन एनी वेयर सो राइट नाउ द प्रोसेस इज गोइंग थ्रू वी एफ एस ओनली इन फ्यूचर इफ दिल इंप्लीमेंट सम न्यू प्रोसेस सो विल लेट यू नो अबाउट दैट ब्रदर पोल एंड वी एफ एस अपॉइंटमेंट देट वट इज द पॉसिबिलिटी ऑफ रिबुक रिबुकिंग द सिस्टम अगैन सो वेट फॉर अ वाइल सो वेट फॉर नेक्स्ट वेंसडे दर माइट बी पॉसिबिलिटी दे आर गोइंग टू ओपन द स्लॉट्स दे हैव रिलीज द नोटिफिकेशन एज वेल सो लेट सी वट इज गोइंग टू हैपन ऑन द नेक्स्ट वेंसडे फाइव सेंटर सोइंग ट्वेंटी फाइव जैन थ्री फिफ्टी इंक्लूडिंग न्यू डेली ऑन फॉर नेशनल डिपेंडेंट सो इफ यू आर लुकिंग फॉर द अपॉइंटमेंट इन नेशनल डिपेंडेंट दैट इज नॉट अ बिग डील एंड आई थिंक यू कैन इजिली गेट द अपॉइंटमेंट सो वी एफ एस रिलीज द स्लॉट्स ऑन रेगुलर इंटरवल्स एंड देर इज एंड इफ आर टॉक अबाउट द डिमांड ऑफ द कैटेगराइजेशन लाइक टूरिस्ट वीजा नेशनल डिपेंडेंट नेशनल अदर एंड नेशनल स्टडी फॉर नॉर्थ जूरिडिक्शन यू कैन इजिली गेट द अपॉइंटमेंट yesterday they open the slots for the i think they release the slots for now north zone only right if i'll talk about people are not getting appointment and you're saying how to cancel because the problem thing is that's not about the people who are booking the right appointment ye un logon ke liye nahi hai ki jisko appointment nahi mila uske baad appointment leke book karte hain bahut sare candidate aise hain un logon ne apna wrong category ke andar appointment book kar diya aur ab jo unki right category hai uske andar appointment ab unko required hai to fir वो अपॉइंटमेंट बुक नहीं कर पा रहे हैं उनके लिए था है अगर किसी ने रॉन्ग कैटेगरी के अंदर अपॉइंटमेंट बुक कर दिया तो उनको कैसे कैंसिल कैसे करना है उसके रिगार्डिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन की इज देर एनी चांस फॉर एजेंसी टू गेट वी एफ एस बल्क अपॉइंटमेंट थ्रू पेड अपॉइंटमेंट ऑन बाई एनी वे ब्रदर आई हैव नो आइडिया अबाउट द पेड अपॉइंटमेंट वट इज गोइंग ऑन राइट नाउ बट द थिंग इज दे आर रिलीजिंग स्लॉट्स इन वेरी लो क्वान्टिटी और आई कैन से वेरी स्मॉल क्वान्टिटी सो पीपल आर वेटिंग फ्रॉम लास्ट टाइम दे पुट होल्ड ऑन दिस वी एफ एस नेशनल अपॉइंटमेंट प्रोसेस If I talk about the appointment thing, so they are not releasing the slots manually from last one month. I can say always slots showing not available for work permit because they have not released the slots from last one month. If I talk about the manual appointment, a last a month, some people have not slots over open. Not done. Then that's why you are getting this notification. One day slots open on Wednesday. Then you can do that. You can check the appointment. Get us at two o'clock. Check it. सर अकॉर्डिंग टू यू वैन विल गेट अपॉइंटमेंट फॉर नेशनल वीजम या मेरे अकॉर्डिंग इफ आई टॉक अबाउट द करंट सिनारी एज पर द एस ओ पी गाइडलाइंस द टाइम इज वेंसडे फ्रॉम इलेवन एम टिल टू पी एम सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर नाउ फ्रॉम माइ नाउ क्लोजिंग द सेशन एंड इफ यू हैव एनी क्वेरीज और क्वेश्चन रिगार्डिंग द प्रोसेस यू कैन आस्क मी इन द कॉमेंट सेक्शन आल इफ आल नो द आंसर आल लेट यू नो द रिजोल्यूशन